occasion. I start, I'm feeling like that freezing weather is starting to subside and then it's starting to see brighter days. Finals fever is in here. Produce is kicking off and we're about to say who wins. How's, um, I've only been told that apparently reserves finals are on Sundays. And That's not what we, we want. Yeah, Version and final. and we now nah, Carlton Collingwood last round got MCC level two tickets, and if we stay where we are fourth, I'm going to be playing fucking footy and Epping or some shit like that instead of going the game. Right. So a couple of days later, on our potty, Jack revealed that he was going to do a celebration, the Jesus, the yeah, Gabriel Jesus. I'll do the Gabriel Jesus celebration soon. Which one is that? I am a the EPL man. The oh, oh the yeah, that'd be good. <laughs> we, we could see this soon, and then you did it against Adelaide. That was a piss. Off. Yeah, that was nice from the pocket, just like turn yeah. straight to the crowd. <laughs> How are you feeling about uh, this week against the D's? I'll be there cheering against you. Yeah. I'll be so, cheering for you, yeah. but a little bit of both. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, it's, uh, it's good. Friday night footy is always going to be good. Hopefully, well, I want to win BT in the rooms. Oh, Roman yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, want to I want to win for BT in the rooms. <laughs> oh, I'll start taking the camera. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Never mind top four. We just want roaming BT, BT after the game. Go downwind. Oh, who's that? Matt McDonald. Oh, massive fan, mate. That's my fan. Huge fan of YouTube channel. Mate, what have you been up to? Oh, uh, mate, just, uh, just got, got, uh, got lots of a few average blokes. Yeah. We took I went Tom towards my car. Oh. I think it was that way, and it's actually right here. We uh, we took Tommy to, to, to get to get the toasties. How's your toasty, mate? Took a second one for the second one. Yeah, let's get it out. This is his second one. So Rog gets into me about the the multiple toppings. This is a multiple toasty, man. That's unreal. Yeah. That'll go down uh, a track. A random combo, but I'm backing it. I'm backing it in. Nice. Well, it's good to, good to bum mate. Yeah. yeah. yeah I mean, love your work. Love, love your work. <laughs> um, done and dusted for another day. We were on the Ball Magnets podcast with Tommy and Ginevan. Um, there'll be a link to that down below in this vlog. But we've had a, had a great day, Baz. Cruisy day. A real cruisy day. Um, and I think those are the best days when you don't really know what's going to happen. It's a bit uncertain. But you make something of it um, and walk into the unknown and seek discomfort. <laughs> oh, I believe he's the same. Hey! Here he is. Monday morning vibes. You're here, mate. Oh, Melbourne! Show him the Show him your new hoodie. I, I absolutely love it. How good is this? Just going for that streetwear skater boy type look. Avril Levine, eat your heart out. He was a skater boy. He says, see you later, boy. That's me, man. Baz, it's exciting to be here. M17. 17? We're up to 17 already. <laughs> We've got Harry Sheasel in. Sheasel. Might not know the name now. You'll know. Come back to this vlog in three years and tell me who the Harry Sheasel machine is. The Sheasel machine. Oh. Doing great things with Sandy Dragons, Vic Metro, taking the piss. Uh, he's going to go top five, drop The best part about eating cheesels is when you got the dust left over on your fingers and you can still suck them and lick them as you're watching your movie and whatnot. The best part about hanging around Harry Sheasel is you've got the sheasel dust left all over you and you've got the sheasel magic coursing through your veins for the rest of your day. But There's a school football grand final that everyone's inviting me down to. BGS versus some college. Isn't BGS a big Korean pop band? BTS. Oh, oh right, my bad. Sorry. Oh, oh yeah. Ash Johnson, four snags. Um, uh, they can't be trading to Goey, can they? The man's a star. Oh, some of the stuff he was doing around the stoppage was, was just nuts. Just could not be tackled. Um, uh, Josh Dagos, potentially all Australian wingman, being lost, uh, lost in the shuffle a bit, like in conversation due to Nick. Langdon tackle and Coxie running off. Oh yeah, we need to start off I reckon unless it's the Langdon chatter. Coxie running off was fantastic. I love that we've got some more characters in the game finally. My boy Trent Bianco, three touches. Let's see the efficiency. Who's our boy this week? 100% efficiency, Trent Bianco. I can't wait to bring that up. I'm gonna write That's that. A great start. Never how better. Are you, how are you? Good, how are you? You're rocking a bit of like the French artiste yeah, sort of look. Oh, at the is it? Liam Carr and Pizza style. I didn't um, Is that a red wine stage or is that meant to be? Oh, it's a, no, it's yeah, a um, beetroot. Oh, I thought yeah, so. Yeah, yeah, I had a bit of beetroot this, this morning. And then just. Yeah, yeah, just tried. Sorry, but thanks for pointing it out. So there you go. Can't make a start of to go. Maybe that's the reason we keep teasing as your season slipped away. You chucked your law out of the door. Said to Steve, oh, play it north. We don't want you. Better 
cut her off without <laughs> That is unreal. Send the gun to sack and now you're trading to get trapped. You didn't have to. You didn't have to. Oh. Didn't have to. Did that video explode? Probably, yeah, one of my biggest. One, two, three, four, five. That's sounding good. Turn is all the way. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Very good, boys. Well done. All right, pass the first test. Harry Sheasel, welcome to Goes All Right. Thanks, guys. Thanks for having me on. How are you, mate? How's your day been? Yeah, good. Um, Yeah, 9.30, but I had did gin this morning. Um, What were we training? Uh, Upper body. Yeah, Yeah. lovely. Off to school after this. Off to school after this. That yep. is outrageous. Uh, yeah, so <laughs> Harry, still doing year 12. Um, and when I hit you up, I was like, oh, mate, you're dominating the NAB League. Uh, you're going to be one of the top, top draft picks for this year. We'd love to get you in for a chat. And you said, uh, well, I've got some spares on Monday morning. Uh, yeah. And I was like, oh, yeah, you're still at school. Harry Sheasel, uh, just on the show. How's head go, mate? Yeah, I think I went all right. Goes all right. You went very all right. You went very, very well. Um, good experience? Yeah, great experience. How did this compare to AFL 360? Oh, I think definitely better. <laughs> Jeez, I'll take that. Definitely I'll absolutely better. take that. Robbo, we're coming for your job. Baz, Monday Arvo tradition post pod is coming down to Gosh's paddock. Last week there was a nuffy proof fence around the perimeter. It is now gone. So we're up close and personal with the superstars of the Melbourne Football Club. Just some absolute yeah. media. <laughs> Superstars, Stars, here to the right. heavy hitters. <laughs> Some of the best in the podcasting Always game. On the Monday, sunny Mondays. <laughs> <laughs> Does the weather get better than this, Baz? In terms of nothingness, going to two open training sessions in three weeks. How? I don't like, think it's open. Going to two training sessions <laughs> in three weeks. How does that rank on the nothingness brigades? <laughs> it's getting. Up. It's getting a bit too much. No, I'm just just showing my commitment to the to the club.